Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The Great House Monmouth was built in 1818 for John Hankinson, who was from Monmouth County, New Jersey. But the estate is best known as the home of General John Anthony Quitman, a governor of Mississippi and well-known figure in the Mexican-American War. In 1853, the Quitmans transformed Hankinson's federal-style home into the opposing Greek revival dwelling that one experiences today. The Quitmans covered the original brick with stucco, scored and painted to look like stone, and added the monumental portico supported by four square columns. Shortly after his purchase of Monmouth, John Quitman embarked on his illustrious political and military career. He was elected to the Mississippi House of Representatives in 1826, served as Chancellor of the State in 1828, and served on the state's Constitutional Convention in 1832. He was acting Governor of Mississippi and became a judge on the High Court of Errors and Appeals. Quitman's greatest fame, however, came during the Mexican-American War, where he served as Brigadier General of Volunteers. He commanded the Southern Assault at the Battle of Chapultepec, and received the surrender of the citadel at Mexico City, where he later served as the military governor. Upon his return to Mississippi, he again served as governor, but was caught up in an ill-fated scheme to liberate Cuba. He was charged with violations of neutrality law, although the charges were later dropped. Undeterred, the former governor and war hero returned to the U.S. Congress in 1855, serving until his death in 1858. In the mid-1970s, the estate was transformed into a luxury inn. Monmouth was listed as a National Historic Landmark in 1988. I'm Samantha Brown, and I moved to Natchez two years ago to work at Monmouth Historic Inn and Gardens. This has been your Natchez History Minute.